welcome back to the pink envelope. I have a lot of really good stuff here. So I literally was in the shower. I usually wash my hair on days I think I'm gonna film. But today I got a notification that the second entry envy box I was waiting on had arrived. So I ran up to my mail sorting company, snagged this box, came back, and we are going to play. I have so many goodies here. So I have a brand new sign, one that has numbers on it. I also want to show you this sign. I've had it outdoors for several months now. I wanna show you how good it's wearing and tearing, being in the weather and the elements. I did not even wipe the cobwebs off. Literally wanted it to be as real as possible, picked it up, sat it down in here. I have a brand new product that Entry Envy is launching in here. I have both of my Halloween designs for October in these. And I wanted to show you my kiddo sign, a follow up on that, also show you uh, how my kiddos decorate their sign. So, I mean, we can start there if we want because I think the way they have it decorated for the month of September is pretty dang cute. So we will have some spoilers. We're gonna have some follow up chat, basically like empty chat, like what do we think now that it's been used? Okay, I'm already making a mess in here. If you're new, Entry Envy is the coolest thing. I discovered them earlier this year. It is a sign, a custom sign company. So this is an Entry Envy sign made of wood. This is an Entry Envy sign made of wood. She has all sorts of varieties of signs. And the coolest part about it is, is once you hang your sign each season, so she has a quarterly option, or monthly, she sends you refill kits to go in here based on a holiday or just seasonal decor. So this is my September. This is what it came like. My kiddos, ooh. This might be their design or they might have added something to it. So one thing we've noticed is even the outdoor refill kits don't wear out. So we are repurposing items from our past kits in with our new kits, the kids especially are since they have the indoor sign and it's not outdoors getting messed up. They mix and match and do all sorts of things. The signs here range from about 59 to 149. I do have a new sign in here that is only 39. The refill kits are $29.99 monthly. They do offer prepay discounts. So if you buy your sign in six months worth of refills, the price drops and drops and drops. But I also have a coupon code. If you use pink 10, you get $10 off a custom sign with the purchase of a monthly subscription. If you use pink 20, you get $20 off a custom sign with a prepaid annual subscription and two months of kits for free. So it's an $80 savings on that one. That's the one y'all y'all use the most, the one that I have seen that's the most popular. And the signs are super customizable. The customer service with Entry Envy is absolutely amazing. So several of y'all ordered this style of sign and y'all don't you don't have to do black. She has different colors that you can use, numbers you can put on it. Um, and needed some customizations. Maybe you had a really, really long address. Or some of y'all have five or six numbers in your address. The Entry Envy team hooked it up, took care of you guys, and y'all all came back and said it was an amazing experience. So if you're on the site and you have questions or you have a customization you don't see offered, reach out to them. I've, I don't think I've ever heard a no come out of their lips. They are about creating solutions and creating awesome signs. I'm going to pop up here the two signs that I have. Okay, this sign here is the Outdoor Vertical Monogram Sign in black ash with white text, and it's just 109. And you can see how big this is compared to my torso. You take it out, and this is the one I've had outdoors for a while now, and hang it up, complete with cobwebs. <laughs> if you do not want to put a hole in something, like let's say you have brick and you don't want to pull a hole in it. Uh, she has different drill bits, brick clips. She has a lot of solutions for hanging your sign. So you can always reach out to her about that as well. She even has how to videos on how to hang your sign. Like literally you should be able to get your sign and put it up all on your own just using the Entry Envy website. She makes it super simple. And then this one here is the one that goes to my kid's playhouse. 
This one's also really good for um, nursing homes to hang on their door or outside of the door. Uh, dorm rooms, college students, because you can hang it using a command strip and put, put this on the door, put this over the top of the door and adhere it and it will hang like this across the door. Uh, obviously, it'll sit on the counter. She does have little stoppers back here so it won't bang and beat up the door. This is the indoor blue pine sign with thoughtful font in white. I'm calling it the kid sign. I think this one was only 59. I have to tell you though, when I talk to the Inter Envy team, these are very, very popular for nursing homes. So I think you could put a room number, you could put a saying, you could put a name, and you could each season, so just four times a year, swap out a beautiful design, or each month, swap out a beautiful design. And she has different design options, and once she knows what your sign looks like and your style preference, she curates the design that goes inside. And then of course you're free, as my kiddos do, to add in other elements that you love on your own. So I looked it up, I'll actually link that video right here, the very first Entry Envy video I did. It's been over six months that this sign has been hanging outside. I have zero cracks, I have dust, obviously. Um, I have zero fading, I don't have any chips. We went through some crazy storms into spring and summer. Bright sun in crazy hot, 110 degree weather, <laughs> and it looks amazing. Okay, enough on these. I mean, these are great. I'm just gonna scoot them over here. Let's see, is that good? Uh, and if you are thinking about getting these as a gift, she can wrap them, she can write cards. She is does all those perfect, and of course, she's an artist. She creates these things. So she can do anything to help you create that perfect housewarming gift, wedding gift. Like you could put like established 2020 on here with their last name, fully customizable to their wedding information. Oh, I love it. Uh, she has gift cards if you wanna do gift cards. Um, we will dive into the October spoilers in a little bit. I want to show you the signs real quick. Uh, these are full spoilers for the Halloween designs, which I have been told by a few of you are really, really, really cute. I even, oh look, I'll put on my Halloween earrings for today. Can y'all see my little... <laughs> this is, is going to be me dressed up for Halloween. I figured I would wear them today since we're doing Halloween stuff. Okay. New sign, like new, new, new to the company, or my sign, my additional sign. We're gonna do my sign. I wanted to show you guys a sign with numbers on it. So I contacted Jennifer, who owns Entry Envy, and was like, can we get a sign sent over that is similar, but not to that, so that you guys could see the difference in some of the options she offers. And she said, yes. Ah, okay, I've gotta show you the presentation, hold on. We're gonna have to make big moves. So, this is what it looks like when you open it. It's very pretty presentation. Everything is wrapped really well, and each time you open one of them, it feels like you're opening a little gift. I have this guy. Love little touch there. Okay, okay. Oh my gosh, there's more in this box than I realized. I have a handwritten no note on here from Jen. And then right here, okay, let me pull this off so I can show this to you. All the instructions you need for installation. Like she really does make it very easy to install your sign. If at any point you hit a hiccup, you can reach out to her and she will help you. She's like a skilled craftswoman and knows how to use power tools. She knows the difference in drill bits. So if you're like, hey, I'm trying to put this into drywall, She'll know how to tell you to do it. If you tell her in advance, she can even include the drill bits that you will need to hang your sign. But if you forget and you message her, she can tell you what to grab from your local hardware store. Okay, so these are non-spoiler kits. This is gonna be a great way for you to see um, just some variety in what she offers on the refill kits each month. This is for the Kids Playhouse, which is this sign right here that they've added a flamingo to. Oh my gosh! Let me show you. She always has a photo, so if you're like, I don't know how I would set this up, you just literally follow her instructions. If you're more creative, you can do whatever it is you want with it. This one actually has a whole candle, so this one has lights. I've seen her do all sorts of like different effects. So you would take 
your current design out. Oh yeah, my kids definitely jacked pieces from it. I think those two go together and I think this goes with something else and I think they put them all together because my youngest daughter's favorite color is purple and her second favorite color is pink. So I guess it was her month to do <laughs> the sign. They're so funny. Okay, so you pull up your pins. There's these little bitty pins she includes and at the base, you're gonna see, let me, Dump off the extra moss, hold on. Styrofoam. In that foam piece, which you can rotate it if it starts to get holes in it, and she does send you refresher foam on your one year anniversary, so you start with a fresh kit. Just thought I'd toss it out there. You open your fresh moss. She always gives fresh pins as well. That's what these two guys attached right there are. They hold your moss so that your things don't blow away. Also, in six months of having my sign outside, I've never had anything blow away. I've never even had anything fall off the sign. Like no, none of the flowers, none of the 3D elements have ever moved. Voila, pin down my moss. I layer moss, so I would have, <laughs> I would have kept that one down and put this one on top because I love the texture and color, but you don't have to layer your moss. Then she is saying to put the leaf in the back and put the orange little bouquet, which you have to unwrap. It's so cute though, like I feel bad unwrapping it. In the front. And then you can add in your candle. Let me see, I'm gonna turn mine on just so we can see it. Hmm, I might even, I mean, I put it over there and it looks pretty like that. But as soon as I put it in, I was thinking if it's dark at night and you put it over here, kind of behind the flower, it's gonna illuminate up the wall, the flower. So you can decide where you would wanna put your candle, whether you want it to be a candle on display or you want it illuminating. So that is an example of what was received in August. I am all about the color. That color makes me very happy. So let me show you what I got for my design in August. Oh, this is so perfectly me. So once again, you have the great presentation with the photo, but look at the colors in mine. I'm just gonna pull it out like this to see if we can see it a little bit better. And so I would take out my sunflower. I'm actually kind of sad to take this out. Also, by the way, this, let me just get real nice and personal. My mic's right there, so I'll get as close as I can. This is what my, I guess my decor items in here look like after being outside for an entire month. They're not like worn out and disgusting. They actually look really good. So that's what I was saying that the items that do get worn out, which have only honestly been one or two things. Uh, the kids have a bucket. We have a bucket, like a, uh, a raffia storage container. And we put all of our Entry Envy items back in there. So then when we come back to decorate our sign, we can put everything we see from our current box plus anything additional we might want to add because we are more as more people. Like we want more as more as more. So I totally, since there's purple in this, totally can see my kiddos sneaking this back into the design, like in a heartbeat. Where's their flamingo? They would do this. This would be their design and they would love it. But in mine, this one's cute. So look at this piece, just once again, this is like a three in one. I also have a candle for mine. So here is the candle. And then I hate to unwrap this because it's so perfect. Y'all see my little flamingo? I guess people know we like flamingos around here. So let's see, how many layers of moss does mine have? It's like I was telling you, I don't take the moss off very often. Looks like one. Oh, just two layers, but this one's like adhered. <laughs> Okay, let's put this guy down here. And then it looks like this guy goes over here. And then it looks like this guy actually trails down the front of the sign. I love that. I have my little guy here. I'm gonna put him over in this corner this time. And my flamingo. I'm gonna put him over here. And voila. Look at this, it's completely opposite of what my kiddos received. I love this dripping now. Now I am infamous about putting it like this and then going and hanging it on the wall and tweaking it and changing it and adding to it. So if you look at it now and you see this and then you see it again in like another video and I've changed it, it's because I love change. I would love to know 
do you love change? I'm an Enneagram 8. I love change. My husband's an Enneagram 7. He loves change. So if you don't mind sharing, what is your Enneagram number and do you love change? That would be kind of a fun thing to know. This subscription works for me because I get to change every single month and even if I get the hankering, I can add in other items and continue to tweak and play. Tweak and play several times in a month. Okay, I had to clean up a bit. I had created a mess before I showed you the new sign. So, several of you asked, if we don't want this printed look, but we want the sign outdoors with numbers, what does it look like? That's what I have for you now. This is the first time I've seen it with numbers and it looks better than I anticipated. And I've seen everything on the website and social media because I super stalk them on Instagram to see all the different designs. I love it. Okay. I need a drum roll, please. I didn't even put the camera up high enough. That is gorgeous. So here is it next to this guy. It's a bit taller. Like I didn't just didn't even think about it. And the back has a hanging plate on it. So you put this piece on the wall. And then once that is on the wall, like flat on the wall sitting there, you can walk up and just hook your sign on easy peasy. She even included, because she knows I have a brick exterior on my home, the nails and the drill bit, you guys. When I say that she makes it thought free, she makes it thought free. So this is an example of, and I wrote down exactly what she sent. This is the outdoor vertical modern floating metal house number sign in black ash with champagne gold numbers. So I wanted to say she has the regular brushed silver, which is silver. She has the regular modern gold. So like if you went and invested in a gold like doorknob knocker set, you would want the modern gold. But if you don't want quite silver, but you don't want that super bold modern gold, this is what you want right here. The champagne gold, it's a nice blend between the two. Uh, let me feel. Weight wise, yeah, it's, it's a little bit heavier, but not, not heavy. Like I anticipated that to be heavy and it actually wasn't. And then as you can see in here, it's completely ready for my first design, which is going to be the October spoiler. So both of these are for October and I'm gonna put one in my kiddo sign and one in my sign. But first I wanna go put this on the house so that you can see this on my house just like you have seen this one on my house so you can have a little bit of comparison. And as if everything we've done thus far isn't like already enough, I have her brand new product line. Like if you went to her website this past week, you haven't seen it. This product line is going live with this video. So as I've chatted with you guys and as Jennifer has chatted with you guys, we have the outdoor signs. Everybody loves their outdoor sign. Everybody loves their in this little, the little kits you get each month or quarterly. If you have not already joined Ask the Pink Envelope Facebook group, go down below in my description. Everything I've mentioned about each one of these signs is down below the description. If you're like, dang it, what color did she say this was? Don't panic, just go down below to the description, look for the number sign. I've got all the specs on this. 
all the specs on this, all the specs on this, so you can recreate at your leisure. I'm gonna have all the specs for this brand new little Envy that I'm about to show you as well. So outdoor signs, great for any home, apartment, condo, wherever. Indoor signs, great for apartments, condos, your kids' playhouses, the entry of your home, uh, college dorm apartments, nursing homes. Now I have a little envy for your business. I know, I know, I know. Once again, the beautiful presentation. We woo! We have a handwritten note on top, and I'm not even exactly sure what all to expect. I'm just gonna kind of lay it out and then we'll play with it. I have seen a, a spoiler like image, but she said she made this little envy for business for my business, and so I cannot wait to see it. I believe these are around $39 but she is doing an introductory offer in this video today. So let me show you this, and then I wanna share the offer. But this sign, where these do the monthly, you have to sign up for the monthly subscription. This you can do monthly or quarterly. This new little Envy, you can do monthly or quarterly as well, you choose. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I haven't even seen it. I can only see the reflection in the camera. So this has my Instagram handle, at the pink envelope, and it has where you can find me, YouTube, Instagram, and Facebook. So she was saying on here that it has the same insides as these, and you can swap with each season, or you can swap monthly, and then you put this on your desk. And she was saying there's all sorts of things you can do. This one here is the Little Envy in white with business card holder and social handles in pink. I got the uh, four seasons, so I'll get four of the kits each year. The introductory offer, if you sign up before October 31st, so get it in before Halloween, is only $97 for your box in all four refill kits. That is normally, $178.96, just for the record. Because quarterly refill kits are $39.99. Monthly refill kits are $29.99. So you're gonna get your box plus $39.99 times four, which is crazy. I wanna show you this, but first let me go get some business cards to put in here. Oh my gosh, that looks so cute. So here is my business card inside of my business card holder box. She said if you don't want a business card, maybe you just want your brand's logo on there. Maybe you want to put a QR code. Let's say you're a wedding vendor, a wedding photographer, or a caterer, or whatever. You wanna put this out with a spread of flowers for the season in there, and you want your QR code on the front so they could walk by and just scan it. You could do that. Let's say you do pop-up markets where you sell whatever items that you're creating. You could totally put your business card, you could put a QR code. This thing can be customized even on the back. You could put it on both sides. You don't have to like stick with one side. You got four sides to play with. So keep that in mind. This is what she did for me knowing that I typically keep my stuff camera facing like this. Okay, she wrote in the notes that this is the fall design shown in here. So let's take a peek. Oh my gosh, it's so good. So once again, you have the instructions and then inside you have all of the products. So I'm gonna pull these guys out and I'm put down the moss. And so if you're like, I, I'm confused by the moss. So let me, let me just literally show you. So here's your box. You're gonna put your moss on top and spread it out. So spreading it out. You're gonna take your pen and just stick it in to push down on the moss. Continue spreading to make sure you have any gaps you don't want showing filled. And push down your other pen. And that's what it looks like. And your moss won't go anywhere. Everything is fully stuck in there. Then you take your design. And this one she has bundled together pretty cute. So I'm not gonna really do much other than slide it here in the back following the photo that she included here. 
put this guy here in the front and voila completely ready to go if i just want to do seasonal updates you can buy the introductory offer of 97 dollars. you're going to get your box and you're going to get all four seasons you're done that is like an epic gift if you're thinking gift and you should be thinking gifts it's october we're moving into that season once again it could be an a parent who maybe they want something in their entry or something in their nursing home or their assisted living maybe it's a brand new business owner and you just want to encourage them with something about maybe they beat a milestone that they had set for themselves or maybe they took that leap of faith that they were scared to for less than $100, you could greet somebody with something beautiful. If this is not quite your style, you have this guy, which is, once again, an under $100 offering. You could buy your sign and a three-month subscription and give it to them. And then if they want to continue the subscription, they can, but they're not obligated to. They still have a beautiful sign. So I keep encouraging us all to keep thinking about gifts. Knock it out earlier rather than later so that you're on the safe side. If you are an entry in the subscriber, lean in and tell people about your thoughts on them. I get to hear all day from you guys on Ask the Pink Envelope Facebook group how much you absolutely love Entry Envy. You love your sign, you love your decor, you love everything about it. So, but come in here, let others know that it isn't just me saying something, but this is truly loved by so, so many people. Also, Entry Envy and I are always up for something fun. We are always brainstorming what's a cool, unique, fun thing. And our fun thing for this time is a giveaway to a business owner. We would like to gift one business owner their very own little envy. To enter to win, all you have to do is like this video, subscribe to my channel here on YouTube, and then comment below your business. Tell us who you are. Put up your website. What do you do? Maybe you are just launching and you want to share how you're just diving in, or maybe you've been doing this for years and you have a tidbit of advice for new business owners, or maybe you're like me, well, you're somewhere in the middle. You've been an entrepreneur for about 16, 17, 18 years, and you're not a newbie, but you're not an old, an OG yet. You're like that middle ground. <laughs> and leave your URL, you leave your website. We would love to know who you are, what you do. I will draw one business owner's name, and we will get you set with your very own little envy for your business. Of course, exclusions apply. You must be over the age of 18 and located in the United States to enter to win. Okay, you guys, that was a lot. But I mean, look around me. Pretty much Christmas for me is happening. Christmas for me always happens in like October. It's pretty amazing. We have so many more really cool subscription boxes coming your way. I want to find more people doing unique things, small businesses, handmade products like we're seeing here that are just kick A. Like they're just doing it better, they're doing it right, they're doing it well, while providing great customer service and a great price point for the things that they are doing. These type of businesses bring so much joy to my life and remind me why I do what I do here because this is just so much fun. If you have not already, subscribe to the channel. You get to see all of the things first when you subscribe because it pops up right into your feed. Uh, we hang out on Instagram and Facebook. So if you want to hang out with us over there, we do a little bit different things. We don't have very many unboxing videos, but we have a lot of behind the scenes, uh, announcements on upcoming unboxings. So you can like over at Instagram or Facebook. And then we do have our Ask the Pink Envelope private group where an intimate group of us hang out and chat about all things subscription boxes. It's a safe space to talk about the things you're loving and the things you aren't loving. And to get feedback and advice from other subscription box lovers and of course request unboxings from me. I hope that you are having an absolutely amazing month of October and that you have a fabulous and spooky Halloween. If you subscribe to the channel, I'm going to see you guys later. Bye y'all.